what is going on you guys how are you if you don't know me my name is carrie i'm a 20 something year old living here in the beautiful city of chicago and today i'm giving you the first look at the new jordan 4 fire reds <laughs> don't know earlier this week on Monday there was a shock drop of the Jordan 4 fire reds these actually don't come out until November 28th but if you were in the know and knew about the drop on the sneakers app you were able to get exclusive access before they became open to the public and I was lucky enough to get my hands on a pair so my package literally just came in I gotta make sure my address is not shown I haven't opened it I haven't seen them so you guys are gonna go ahead and see my first reaction um, a question I will probably get is people are like, how do you know about the shock drops? Um, honestly, my dog is drinking water. So one of the questions I feel like I'm going to get a lot of is how do you know about the shock drop? And actually, if you follow, um, let me see, let me see, let me see. Who is it? I'm like forgetting their name. Okay, if you're on Twitter, follow J23 app. I'm sure all of you already follow him. Um, make sure you turn on notifications and he will, or she, I shouldn't assume it's a guy. Um, they will give you like all the latest stuff that's going on on sneakers, what's dropping, what you should be prepared for. And that is how you can stay in the know on what's going on on sneakers because as everybody knows, it's not an easy hit to do. So let's just dive into these. This is actually my first pair of fours. I have um, a good amount of ones so far and I have the fragment threes. So this is my first pair of fours um, that I've ever gotten and I honestly don't know how I'm going to feel about them. I don't know if I'm going to keep them. So we shall see what we think. So of course you have the classic Jordan box in there. I got the size. I think I got a six. Yeah, I got a six Y. Um, I'm always GS. I feel like GS is way easier to get your hands on. And let's go ahead. I'm gonna open this with you guys. It's like the cement packaging. Oh my gosh, I like them way more than I thought I would. Okay. So here you have you always got to you always got to smell them. Here you have the fire red Jordan 4s. I'm going to go ahead and insert a little B-roll. <laughs> really really like it I like the four silhouette I think it's probably my next favorite um, after the one so I do like this I don't know in photos and maybe even on video this came off more orange looking to me so I wasn't super excited about it but now that I'm seeing it in person I'm kind of with it let me see okay I do have a complaint I do have a complaint yeah okay so I, like, as you guys know, I'm like very new to the sneaker world. Like, I'm very, very new to it. I will never ever claim to know everything. But I thought fours came with like the cool little square tab. Does this not come with that? It doesn't. I was low-key so excited for that. I thought that would have been so cute. I would have put it on my keychain. I would have been like a little girly girl. Um, but no, it doesn't come with that. Oh, that kind of stinks. Do you guys know why? Does anybody know why that is? Can you tell me down below why that is? But initially looking at the shoe, it's a solid shoe. I feel like it's a good colorway. Like I feel like anything red and black with Jordan is gonna hit. Um, it is a little weird because I have these so, so early. Like November 1st is on Sunday and I have them. Um, looking at the quality, I don't know. I feel like these look a little 
like sloppy. I'm not normally the one to kind of like tear apart quality um, cause I've worked in retail for so many years, like I get it. But these kind of look like, I don't know if you guys can even see that, but there's like glue on the upper right there. I don't, like again, I've never had a pair of fours. This is my first pair. But like the quality is eh. Like I feel like compared to my mochas or my fragment threes, like the quality is definitely better on those than these. But let me get, let me know what you guys think about this shoe. I feel like this is gonna hit on November 28th. I'm hoping it'll hit, so then I already have them. Um, but again, I feel like it, you can't really go wrong with a red, black, and white colorway with Jordans. I feel like it's classic, it's very Chicago. Um, so I feel like it'll do well. But let's go ahead and see these on foot and see what they look like. that you have seen them on foot this does only come with the white laces again I should know more about fours than I do but I think I definitely would switch out maybe even put black laces in here I feel like that would be really hard to have black laces um, on my shoe scale I would give this like a 7 out of 10 I like it I'm not as excited about like this shoe than I am like the off-white for the mochas or anything like that but i do think it's going to be a solid shoe to have in your collection um i would definitely try to hit on sneakers and see how that goes so these yeah i think i'm gonna give them like a seven out of ten but thank you guys so so much for watching again i cannot say thank you enough for all the love i got on my last mocha video i feel like my dms are going crazy on instagram i like I, I was very overwhelmed with how you guys like that. So I'm super excited to definitely step up my channel and take it to the next level and show you guys all the good stuff that I get. Um, let me know down below if you guys want to see like early releases. My company I do work for, Endless Supply, we do get early Yeezys, we get early Jordans, we get everything early. So if you guys want me to snag a pair and kind of show them to you on camera before release date, definitely let me know. I'm not always going to be able to put them on foot because I don't buy every single pair of shoes contrary to what everybody thinks of me um but yeah definitely let me know and then again if you guys want shoes we sell out so fast like i probably had 20 to 30 people dm me on instagram for mochas um and let me just talk about mochas for a second i think mochas are definitely dropping in value i'm going to be totally honest and say i don't think they're going to hit as hard as everybody else does because a there's so many pairs coming out I think we all didn't expect that many pairs to come out and B, I just think everyone's calling it the poor man's Travis Scott. Everyone is like not super excited about it um, now that they're getting them in hand. I think over the years, it's definitely going to be a shoe that you're going to want to hold on to because I think over the years, it's going to be one of those shoes that's going to go anywhere from four to seven, eight hundred dollars. I think it's such a solid colorway. But I don't think they're, they're going to hit the way everybody is hoping to. So definitely try on sneakers. Definitely keep your keep your hands on them if you can. Um, again, I'm so sorry to everybody that reached out to me. I was not expecting that many people to reach out. But just keep me in your DMs. And if any other shoe comes out, just let me know. And I'll be able to slide you in before we actually tell people that we have them. Um, I do have the ability to do that. But back to the Fire Red 4s. These are cool. I think these are cool. I don't know. It's my first red shoe. It's my first four, so I'm super excited about it. And, oh, there's crazy sounds. All right, well, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe. I do upload every single Thursday. Leave a comment down below letting me know what you guys want to see. Should I do a Jordan collection? Should I do an entire sneaker collection? Should I, like, vlog my life? Do you guys want to see behind the scenes at Endless Supply? Definitely. Let me know down below. Follow me on Instagram. Follow Endless Supply on Instagram. And I will see you guys next Thursday. Deuces.